Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome back to the channel, Chatter. Oh, sorry, just finished eating some lunch. And, um, oh, gosh, I made some awesome Polish cookies. Mm. What's even more so, they're, they're Polish cookies and then there's jam in them. And it was homemade jam. Oh, how many of you guys like homemade stuff? Come on. Cookies, you know, the donuts, breads. Oh, I love them. Well, anyhow, that's not about that, is it? No. No. Ooh, bright light. I want to get you guys in the light. Um, I got great news for some of you. So, uh, yeah, we're enjoying a beautiful day here in the PNW. Look at that. Oh, man, it is a beautiful day today. Woo-wee. Just gorgeous. But we do still have snow. Yes, we do. We got a lot of snow. And I think we're going to have snow the, pretty much the rest of February and beginning of March, uh, which is quite rare out here. But uh, let's get in the shop and i show you some things I gotta get out. Alrighty, I'm sure this will wreak havoc on the camera because it is sunny outside. But, uh, gotta put away the wicked edge. Because, oh, I got some knives sharpened. That is right, guys. I have knives going out. And these are coyotes. Yes, they're coyotes. This is so cool. This is the next five coyotes going out here, actually. But matter of fact, let's get the tubs down. And uh, here we go. I've got packages. i got boxes to get wrapped up here and do everything. But... Um, yeah, this is so cool. I'll set you guys up again. Since I already moved, I'll set you up and we can take a look at these. Alrighty, gang. So, uh, yeah, first and foremost, um, this is, I gotta, I gotta shout out to everybody that's been supporting, uh, CK Knife and Tool. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it. I'm actually hoping maybe at some point in time I get to meet a lot of you. Uh, maybe if I got the opportunity in case he runs the, uh, second annual, uh, Cowdy Works Jamboree or something down in Oregon. I'm actually uh, kind of already thinking about making my trip down there and uh, meet a lot of people that I didn't get to meet last year in 2018. I really wanted to do that, but I couldn't get away. I'm hoping to actually make the time to actually do it this year. So, really cool. Uh, so, some shout outs here. Um, really, I don't have to begin with anything other than uh, here we go. We'll go to Brandon K. Now, all the Cowdy Works knives, you can get all the information on uh, the previous videos as well as on my website. CK knife and tool, uh, but they all come standard, uh, full tang, they're uh, CPM D2, they're approximately 10 inches in length, um, and they get uh, canvas micarta scales. You have your choice of either black, olive drab, or a natural, and a natural is kind of like a mustardy yellowish color. It's kind of a neat look. Um, you get the Kydex, of course, you get your choices of black, olive drab, or coyote brown, and every one of them gets a tech lock. I've had some people in the past reach out and I, I said, yes, not a problem. They go to the website, they can buy it, and you can upgrade your Coyote to CPM 154 stainless steel. It can still get the uh, sandblasted finish, which is what all the Coyote Works knives get. It's that matte gray finish. You could, it's got a bunch of 3-in-1 uh, oil on it, so excuse the, uh, the look. But, uh, yeah, so Brandon, this is yours, Brandon K. I'm not going to say your guys' last names because I just don't want to do that to you. Not sure you'd be comfortable with that. Here's Brandon's. Here's Dave B. Dave B also got a Coyote Brown with the Olive Drab. Uh, standard Coyote Works knife. Really nice. Um, really liking these knives. I really do. It's a really simple knife, but a really good feeling knife. Nice fit finish. Really comfortable. Uh, oh, here we go. Steph. Mr. and Mrs. Steph. Or I should say Steph B and Mrs. Steph. Because I don't know Steph's wife's name. Steph and his wife each have a his and hers knife. Uh, one of them is getting olive drab with olive drab scales. The other one's getting coyote brown in olive drab scales. Both with tech locks. Um, but yeah, it was pretty cool. Got a husband and wife knife set here. So thanks, Steph. I appreciate it. That's, that was awesome uh, for the, the, the two knife purchase. I do thank you for that. And then last but not least, Anthony A. Anthony A. Olive drab on olive drab with a tech lock. Again, everything else easy going, you know. I like I said, I'm really liking these. They're really simple. Um, Casey, I think, has been loving his knife from what I'm hearing, and I'm glad to hear it. And hopefully, a lot of you guys 
will be out in the woods and fielding your knives this summer for 2019. Um, if you want more information, again, jump over to ckknifeandtool.com. You can pick out stuff. I've already had customers change it out from being a standard Coyote Works knife. They've gone to CPM 154 stainless steel. They've decided to have a different maybe belt loop as well as they upped a little bit and got a fancier Kydex, which is that raptor skin, that leather looking. And I've actually had some people request wood or pins, custom pins, like a nice, uh, not the big fancy decorative pins that I have, but a little nice custom pin of some sort. So those are options. Just jump over to the website. You can peruse through and look through everything and take a look. And uh, that'd be it. So again, guys, I do appreciate it. Thank you very much for the support. On behalf of Casey, as well, thank you, and hopefully we'll see some of you guys here in 2019. Take it easy. We'll see you next video. Bye.